an important um, event for us today. This is a, uh, we're bringing to fruition something that started at the end of, started in, in, in 2009, eventually with a decision that brought the uh, EASO here in Malta. Under the circumstances, in view of the developments in Libya, the role of this agency in Malta gains in importance, and we are looking forward to be able to work closely with the agency here in Malta in order to be able to develop, to the benefit for the whole of the European Union, a policy that is a constructive and positive policy with respect to asylum. I must recognize the presence of the executive director, Dr. Bassa, here as well, and the fact that the agency has already started its first steps, concrete steps, to function in accordance with the terms of agreement that were given to it. In fact, the first initiatives were taken with respect to the special events with Greece, and we are following closely what is happening there in order to be able to see the agency function in the best possible way. I take this opportunity to express my sincere best wishes and uh, augur for the success of the agency and promise that uh, the agency will continue to receive the full support of the Maltese government for it to be able to operate efficiently from Malta in the best interest of the whole European Union. Commissioner. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much uh, for inviting me here today. It's a pleasure to be in Valletta. We have had uh, very good talks this morning with Prime Minister and uh, uh, Minister uh, of Interior and Justice. But of course, the, the main uh, reason for me to be here today is to inaugurate the newest agency of the European Union, the EASO. I think EASO has uh, gained in importance ever more since the decision was taken uh, to have it here. And I am convinced that it will contribute a lot to the important work of the European Union now that we are trying to set up a common European asylum system where asylum seekers will be dealt with uh, in a more harmonized way where the systems will be more equivalent all around the European Union. I would like to express my gratitude for the Maltese government who have done and a fantastic work to put all this together and also the work of Mr. Uh, Rob Fisser who has already, as the Prime Minister said, started working on this. The ASO will be a true contribution to the whole of the European Union with uh, education, training, monitoring and assistance and uh, I am really proud to open it today and uh, I'm looking forward to work with it and I would like to assure the Maltese government, as well as the director, that the Commission will continue to support and work very closely.